Hello YouTube. This is my new version of my Oladino clock. You might have noticed there are no more buttons on the top and no more dip switches on the side. This is a new PCB that I designed. It has a navigation button up, down and push in on the right and two miniature slide switches on the left. And let's see, turn it on, here you see it. This is the screen. And there's also no more um, LED sticking up from the back. Plus the piezo buzzer is a miniature one now. And of course he has the charging port, board. And let me show you the menu real quick. You go into the menu by clicking on here and advance forward. Right now it's 2 in the morning, 2.14. Let's make this 2.15. You adjust the minutes and hours by pushing up, 2.15. Push in again. Okay, now the alarm is set. You have a voltmeter around here and the uh, temperature. For people in US, I have it in 12 hour mode and in Fahrenheit also. And as you see, you have the four LEDs in the corners as a visual indication. And the buzzer is switchable. You can turn it on and off. And this is it. I think it looks nice. And if you want to turn off the alarm before the minute is up, normally it runs a minute. You just click on here and it turns off. Till you turn it on the next time. Okay, I will pause the video and I have a surprise also. Just a second. Okay, here we go again. What did I do? Do you notice this thing here? It is a magnetic charging port now and you have a cable and you just click it and then it's connected and it's charging right now you see it by the red LED in the middle here on the charging board and you just take it off like this click it on like that take it off like that click it on like that take it off like that and this will be an option when it goes on sale on Tindy. You can of course get it without it also. Plus I will be offering some extra of these little plugs. So you can plug them in to your cell phone handy, um, tablet, wherever you have a micro USB port. And then you can use this cable with those devices also. It does charge on both ways, facing forward and facing backwards. See? And then I plug it off, it goes out. But if you use it on your phone, if you have da data transmission, it only goes one way. Depending which way your plug is going into your device. Anyway, this is the newest version. And I will be making the GPS cube also with this board. So you will have no more buttons on the top. All are on the side, the navigation switch and the slide switches. Well, this was it for an update. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked it. And take care.